Oil companies and drilling rig operators are entering uncharted waters as they fight over who should pay for rigs idled by the recent U.S. offshore drilling moratorium, and on one case has already landed in court. While offshore drilling could legally resume after a federal district court judge overturned the moratorium on Tuesday. If any oil companies are likely to go back to work until higher courts rule on appeals, officials at several companies said. Meanwhile, the unused rigs are costing them as much as $600,000 a day. At least three oil companies are demanding early exists from long-term leases on fire rigs in the Gulf of Mexico, alleging that the ban on offshore drilling voided their contracts. BP Group Chief Economist Christoph Ruhl said on Wednesday that the temporary ban on deepwater offshore drilling in the U.S. will have an impact on global oil supplies, particularly if it spreads to other countries. In general, I think that limitations to deepwater oil exploration will have consequences for supply, Rule told reporters in Perth after representing BP's annual review at World Energy. It is obviously a fast-growing segment. We have moratorium in the US. We have similar kinds of moratoriums in the Norway as well. Well, that's all for now. Do come back later for more.